Do you wanna use Instagram on your computer, but you keep getting frustrated? I'm gonna walk you through all the updates that Instagram has made for desktop use. And stick around to the end where I tell you my favorite tool for scheduling posts from the computer to Instagram. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell where you'll get notified of my Instagram videos that are released here every Monday. I'm Subi Zimmerman and I've taught thousands of business owners how to make money on Instagram. And today I'm gonna to teach you how to use Instagram from the computer. It's true, posting directly from Instagram from your computer is not an option, but as a user, you can enjoy all the features that Instagram has to offer. Let's take a look at all the ways you can view the different areas. We'll start with my favorite, Instagram Stories. When you open up Instagram on your desktop, you'll see here on the right-hand side, Stories, and you can tap in and watch all the stories from the people that you follow. When the story ends, it continues on to the next follower. And if you wanna quickly tap through the story, just tap right here on the arrow on the right and you can move it quickly. Ninja tip, use the search bar at the top if you're looking for a particular profile to browse. I'm just gonna search right here at the top and I can quickly tap in and view their whole account or view just their Instagram story. Let me show you how to access IGTV right here if you have highlights, it's under your highlights. If not, it's under your bio. Tap in and you will see all the videos that have been uploaded and you can view them very easily by tapping in. To watch other people's IGTV, you do the same thing. You just search for their name, tap into their account, and then tap into IGTV. And they have some great videos where you can explore areas that you probably have never traveled. Saved post. You can also view your saved post. This tab right here, it looks like a ribbon icon. If you tap in, you can look at all the posts that you've saved either to a category or just have saved because you got inspiration from the photo, maybe the video. I like to view a lot of my posts from the desktop, especially ones where they write information and content that I actually wanna copy and paste like this recipe because you cannot copy and paste directly from the app. Another reason saving posts to the desktop and viewing them there is beneficial is because you can quickly tap through by tapping on this arrow right here, all of your saved posts. It's also really easy to share someone else's content that you love by just tapping on that post. I know this one's gonna make you laugh. And tapping on the up arrow and sharing it either to Facebook or on Twitter or in an email or copying and pasting and sharing that link with someone else. Tell me, I wanna know in the comments below, are you just starting to use Instagram or have you been using it for a while? And if so, how many years have you been on Instagram? Tagged photos. Tag posts are photos or videos that you've been tagged in because you can now get tagged in videos and they show up here. What you're looking at are all the photos that I've tagged because I tag my own photos, but occasionally you'll see posts from other people that have tagged me on their photo as well. Highlights. I love that you can view your highlights from the desktop. All you need to do is just double tap in and you can just let it play or you can control the highlights by tapping forward with the arrow or tapping back if you wanna go back. Once you X out, you can view into another highlight or it will continue onto that highlight once it's gone through all the clips in this highlight. To access someone else's highlight, just search the user account you wanna go check out. The happy news, we love the happy news. Just tap into their highlight and you can watch it on the desktop. If you're looking to use Instagram highlights for your business, I linked a video for you. Are you ready for the tool that I mentioned in the beginning that really helps you schedule your post and save you a ton of time? It's Planoly. You can schedule your post in Planoly, which is awesome. I, I have all these unscheduled posts waiting for you wonderful people to view soon. And you can schedule your stories by tapping in the S right here and adding a new story. If you're looking to create a strong Instagram strategy this year to make money on Instagram, grab my free 2019 strategy guide. The guide will totally empower you for success on Instagram. Did you like this video? Hit subscribe, give me some good vibes, be sure to give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below, do you prefer using Instagram on your mobile or on your desktop? And don't forget to follow me on Instagram at the Instagram expert where I share Instagram tips 
every day. And I'll see you in the next video.